It's Sunday, August 26th in the year 2018. Put your ear to the sky. Can you hear the train a coming? All aboard the rapture train. Good morning, YouTube, my beautiful, wonderful, glorious, simply amazing, Holy Spirit-filled, rapture-ready, precious brothers and sisters. Gather around, pull up a chair, let me know what are you going to share with PD as we begin this Sunday together. I've got my coffee with cream, and I don't put any sugar in my coffee. Do you? How do you take your coffee? Do you even drink coffee? Are you going to have some herbal tea? It's going to be hot today. Maybe some iced tea and lemonade. Let me know in the comment section below. Oh, I'm so ready to go home. The deception, the lies, the evil that has this blanketed this earth. And this is not our home. This is not our home. Our home is with our precious Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Getting ready to head out uh, this afternoon. For our worship in the park in Flint, Michigan, Riverbank Park. And I want to thank our volunteers. We've got a few church ladies from a, a neighboring church in uh, Grand Blanc, Michigan. But they are preparing the meal for today. And we are just going to have a very blessed Sunday. We're going to preach to the homeless. Give them a sermon today. And we've got a lot of food and a lot of clothes. I want to thank... Brother Randy, Brother Randy, who sent me an email, and he sent a great big box, just what we need, of size 2X, uh, 2X shirts, extra large, two extra large shirts, a big box full of beanies for the winter, and a gigantic box of socks for the homeless, and we are just going to have a very, very blessed day. Ministry announcements. I want to thank also the Chapmans, who always give to this ministry. I think as long as I've been on YouTube, out with the homeless, the Chapmans have always supported our ministry and outreach to the homeless. One hundred dollars, and I put out the call. I wish more people would come forward. Those that could give, and uh, for Father God to just open up a new door so we can continue on with this ministry and i want to thank claudia for a gift of two hundred dollars and i've got no room on my desk my desk is a mess you should see the clutter oh my goodness courtney i want to thank courtney i got in the mail a check to our ministry for the homeless of 25 dollars and lewis Oh, Lewis, I almost fell on the floor. I'm not used to large offerings coming into our ministry. And this touched my heart. And uh, I know Father God is opening new doors to this ministry. A precious gift. All the way from Pennsylvania, Brother Lewis. $500 to support our ministry and outreach to the homeless. i got to have another sip of coffee. We have a very special special meal plan today and i will be filming in uh, flint michigan at riverbank park until they come and tell me i can't and then i'm still gonna continue to feed the homeless and pray for them and have their own church service in the park just for the homeless and for anyone else that wants to come in here you know i see a lot of things on the internet and uh, you know i've been out there Street preaching, you can go out and take your bullhorn. And Jesus is the only way. Repent, repent. The kingdom of God is at hand. It doesn't cost anything to go out. I've got videos. You've seen the videos. We'll talk about this tonight at 8 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We're going to have live church tonight. I know I'll be tired after our worship in the park, but we're going to have a live church tonight, our live stream we'll talk about that at eight o'clock i have videos of me out holding signs honk for the homeless honk for jesus and uh, uh preaching on the street it doesn't cost anything i've got 
numerous videos, teaching videos from all over the years where we're actually teaching uh, from the Bible on uh, UFOs, aliens, and fallen angels a whole lot. I think it was like a 14-part series. And The Thief in the Night, a teaching on that with Brother Doug. Uh, and uh, Nimrod, uh, The Return of the Antichrist, and, and on chemtrails and all types of teachings. It doesn't cost anything to be on YouTube. It doesn't cost anything to be on Periscope and the other formats. It doesn't cost to preach. But someone is at it again, leaving a million dollar, no job, leaving a million dollar mansion in California because they got caught. Now moving to Texas, now they're saying it costs money to get out there and evangelize on the street and hold up signs and to preach. It costs a lot of money, a lot of, a lot of uh, expenses. There is no expense. An outreach where you're out feeding and you're out uh, providing service for the community and for the homeless. You're providing clothing and the transportation to doctor's appointments and OBGYN um, and getting them their driver's license and getting them, uh, uh, getting them connected to where they can get on disability. That, it's a great, uh, great uh, financial strain. But just to be on YouTube, it doesn't cost anything but the things I see. Yes, Anita Fuentes, the million dollar, million dollar lady. She's at it again. John McCain, John McCain uh, passed away. I just want to touch on this uh, real quick. I have nothing to say negative towards the dead, those that have passed on. I pray, but he knew Jesus uh, before he went on and uh, left this world. I pray that he really, really invited Jesus in his heart. Um, and I don't judge. God is the ultimate judge. And I just pray for him. But when the news broke, it was uh, I was scrolling across Facebook and there were all kind of mainstream media news outlets reporting on the death of uh, uh, John McCain. And instead of talking a little tiny bit about him being a, a prisoner of war and a war hero, it was 30 minutes, 20 minutes, 15 minutes of nothing but bashing Donald Trump. Bashing Donald Trump. There's a time and a place for everything. I love you guys. I'm getting ready for our worship in the park. Pray for this ministry. Father God is opening new doors. We need, we need your help. We need your help not to have a million dollar mansion, not to have material things of this world. We need your help to make a difference, to touch lives, to feed the poor, to feed and clothe the homeless. Jesus said, when I was thirsty, you gave me drink. When I was hungry, you gave me meat. When I was naked, you clothed me. Brothers and sisters, we need your help. I'll put all the links below to how you can support this ministry and outreach to the homeless. See you real soon.